Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for, oh, what is it? It's, I don't have my calendar changed. Oh, yes, I do. The 7th, for around the 7th. So, you know, the timing is for this could be for the weekend. This could be for next week. This reading may or may not be for you, so we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have? What do we have for a reading today? Ooh, what happened here? We got a card that flipped. We do. We're going to take a look at it here. Ooh, hee hee, yikes. Well, the Queen of Pentacles reversed. Now, this is unstable insecure hmm. we may know we may have somebody that doesn't know their value or they may be letting something go something that is not a value the queen of pentacles in reverse is somebody that is very possessive and insecure this person uh, is suspicious and jealous so there could be some jealousy issues here. Hmm. Well, interesting. Now, it looks to me like she's letting something go. That's what I just want to say. It's like she's letting something go. Or she's giving something away. I don't know. That's reverse. So five of wands. There's a competition here of some sort. A struggle. Somebody is struggling. Maybe struggling to let go of something. Hmm. There could be an argument or something. Oh, yes, there could be. There could be an argument or something. Yeah, something is happening. I don't know. Maybe there's going to be an argument. Maybe it's with a child. I don't know. There could be a fight. This, is, this could be in-house fighting. It could be. Now, this is a message that you don't want to hear. This is some sort of conflict. Somebody could get angry. You notice it's kind of like a fist. This person looks a little pissed off. I don't know. Something is going on. Some some sort of argument is coming by the looks of things. Some sort of petty behavior, petty fight. This one may be, you know, Jealous. She may be jealous. This is somebody is jealous of something. Distrustful. Suspicious. Yes. We have somebody here that is very suspicious and distrustful. Maybe she's afraid of competition. Hmm. Refusing to compromise. We got somebody here that is, is like, this person is not going to budge. Very stubborn. Very, very stubborn. Somebody that refuses to compromise, has a chip on their shoulder. Um, somebody that wants their own way. So I think there's going to be some sort of petty situation that comes into focus. Okay, there's going to be like a fight. It's just a stupid argument of some sort. Somebody is very... Uh, they want to get their own way, and so they're gonna they're gonna fight. They they may you know pout or some, beg, uh, victim victim mentality. They may be begging for some sort of attention. You know, any attention is attention. This person must need some attention. You know, so even if they're gonna get negative attention, you know, at least it's attention. So we got somebody here that is begging for an attention in a negative way. Okay, so get prepared for that. There's going to be some sort of argument. <laughs> Somebody's going to get angry. They're going to get very angry. They see themselves as a victim. They're living, it's like they're in some sort of circumstance and they're a victim of that circumstance, but they're not, right? But that's what this is about. It's like they may blame, they may blame somebody for their circumstances, but we always can get out of any circumstance that we're in if we choose 
But anyway, we have somebody here that um, is very disagreeable. So be prepared to deal with somebody that is very hard to deal with in the near, near future. This person is kind of like this person is looking for a fight. And it's because they need some attention. Okay? They do. They need some attention. Um... Now, this is a card of abandonment. Somebody has been abandoned or feeling neglected. That's what this is about. Somebody's feeling neglected, so they're going to, it's like they're going to demand attention. They are in a negative way. Now, this is mastering emotions. Maybe somebody needs to just go get in their car to get some space, you know, just go sit in your car. Take a time out. I don't know where that's coming from, but maybe that's the best option. Maybe take a ride. Take a breather. If, if you're dealing with this person and this person just wants to fight, maybe you just, you know, take a ride. Take a ride. Interesting. Um, let's just get some more cards. Somebody needs an attitude adjustment. <laughs> wow, there's definitely going... Somebody could leave without saying goodbye. This could be leaving without saying goodbye because there's a fight. Somebody may be, and they may decide to ghost. They may decide to abandon this person that fights all the time. Maybe this person fights all the time. It's been a struggle. It has been a struggle. It's like somebody's been walking on egg, eggshells. This person is jealous. They're suspicious. All they do is uh, accuse. And it's like an accuser. It's like they accuse, 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 accuse. And it's like, you know what? I'm leaving. Um, somebody could be leaving without saying goodbye. Abandoning. It's like ghosting this person. Somebody may be being ghosted. And they may be being ghosted because, you know, of their behavior. And this person needs an attitude adjustment. It's like, you're such a bitch. I don't even want to deal with you. So somebody is dealing with a really nasty individual who... They can't, they can't work with this person because this person is so stubborn. I mean, so stubborn. So, yeah, we have a really stubborn individual that is basically pushing somebody away because of their behavior. It's like it, it takes two. You don't get to always have your way. So, yeah, we have somebody here who, you know, it's my way or the highway, and it doesn't work like that. It doesn't. So somebody could be leaving, you know, getting in their vehicle without and just not even saying goodbye. Taking the high road. See ya. You know, um, you get the world reversed. This is like, this is, that's like that, that, uh, this is, this is a dead end. This is, a, this is a flogging a dead horse. Okay. There's no positive change. There's too much resistance here. So somebody is dealing with somebody that <laughs> will not budge. This person will not budge. It's like, it's my way or the highway. And whoever they're dealing with is like, fuck you sorry but that's what I got to say about that seeing clearly seeing no you know I know what I gotta do somebody is seeing clearly that there's a better option you know I may you know they made a poor choice and now there's consequences so somebody is the person that is so stubborn is about to experience some consequences okay Because whoever they are uh, fighting with is going to leave. They don't want to... They're leaving. They're leaving. Uh, it's like, I don't need to be in this troublesome situation anymore. I don't want to fight anymore. I want peace in my life. I want harmony. And if you just want to fight, then... Uh, <laughs> tough shit. So, you know, I feel like there's going to be some communication. It's like it, somebody's going to get so mad that it's like, you know what? I can't take this anymore. Somebody's leaving. Somebody is leaving. I, this is this is a dead end. It is a dead end. And it's, there's too much resistance. This person is is very insecure with who they are, very jealous, very vindictive. Um, and, you know, it's just whoever... The, the vindictive person is the jealous, suspicious, vindictive, uh, stubborn uh, person is about to uh, experience ghosting. Okay, it's like it's and, and saying it's like, bye. I can't help you. 
I can't help you. Somebody is leaving this person. It's like I can't help you. It's like I'm gonna deal I'm gonna deal with the opposition. I, I'm getting out of here. Somebody is leaving this nasty individual behind. And that it doesn't and I don't know what sign it is. It, it, could, it could be any sign. This person is very childish. Very, you know, it's their way or the highway, and it doesn't work like that. So yeah, it's over. It's done. It is. It's completely over. It's like this is this is this is too much. It is too much. It's like this person, it's just, they've reached the point of collapse. This is, this is mental overload of giving up. We have somebody that is giving up. It's over. It's over. Goodbye. Somebody is absolutely positively saying goodbye. They are saying goodbye to an individual that is, is so jealous and so stubborn and so egotistical and materialistic and uh, jealous. I think I already said that. This person is lazy. This person is possessive. This person, you know, all they want to do is fight. It's like, <laughs> no, uh -uh, I'm done. I'm done. So I think that, and it, we could be dealing with, you know, I think there could be a masculine that is making this decision. This is somebody that is very wise, has a lot of life experience, could be dealing with an Aries, doesn't have to be. This is a, this is a masculine that, you know, takes the lead, takes action. Um, it's time to use their head. It's like, I, I got to use my head here. Uh, this is about the, this is the facts, you know, the, the, the hard fact is, is that you're not going to change, you know? And this is like, this is somebody that is judging a situation based on the facts. This guy is making a decision. So we have somebody, we, I think we do have a masculine that is making a decision to take back control of a situation. They have been dealing probably with a feminine that is so controlling that it's just like, you know what? It doesn't work like this. There's something wrong with you. What the hell is wrong with you? Why can't you be nice? Anyway, we have this, this person that is just too much. It's like they're so controlling. And I think we have somebody that is about to boss up. It's like, you know, you're not the boss of me. So in this, this, I think the masculine is taking action. I do. It's like, you know what? Uh, I'm not going to deal with this. this. I think somebody is leaving without saying goodbye. It's like they're going someplace else or they're kicking somebody out. They're making that person leave. Somebody is leaving. Somebody is leaving. End of story. End of story. Seriously. Somebody's leaving. And, and it's because there's some sort of fight. Okay. There's some sort of argument. This is so petty. It is so childish. This person needs an attitude adjustment. It's like something, you know, it's like they just can't let go of something. We have this, this person up here is stuck. They are stuck. They're just refusing to let something end. They're refusing to let go. They're refusing to move on from something. You know, they they really have a big, huge chip on their shoulder. We have somebody here, I mean, that really thinks that their shit don't stink. They want their own way, no matter what. It's like, it's all about them. This is somebody who is very shallow and, you know, self-absorbed. And I think something is going to happen. There's going to be some sort of argument, okay, that happens that causes somebody to, it's almost like pack up and move. That's what, There's definitely moving here. Somebody sees clearly with the Seven of Cups. It's like they become clear that it is time to move on. This is a dead, it's over, it's done.
so yeah there is definitely a decision that is being made and it is it's it's like you know what this is too much for me i can't do this anymore i really can't do this anymore it is over somebody has been bitching 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 all they do is bitch So now they're about to be left behind. It's like, pfft. see ya, I don't need this in my life. One more card, please. One more card. Being relieved of your obligations, packing up and leaving home. See you later. I know there's a better option someplace else. Somebody has been in a deep depression dealing with this nasty individual. And now they just want to focus on the future. Five, five, five. Five, five, five. Expect the unexpected. Everything changes. Life changes. Somebody is making a major choice that is going to change their path. It's been a huge power struggle. It has been, there's been a lot of conflict. There's been a lot of adversity. And now it's time to let go of this to bring in the new. So expect something to change. And this is a big change when you get 555. It is a change that is needed to bring peace and harmony into your life. Because what comes after 555666? Somebody has been in a situation, here we have a six, here we have a six. Somebody has been in a situation that hasn't been peaceful. There hasn't been any harmony. And they've been clinging to it, hoping that things would get better. But things are about to get worse. Because whoever this person is, has a huge chip on their shoulder and they aren't going to change. Now this person is going to experience a setback and they're, they've been refusing to learn any lessons. They don't need to learn any lessons because they already know it all. This know-it-all about to learn a lesson the hard way in the form of goodbye. So anyway, expect something to change and it is going to be a very big change. This person that is so disagreeable, that uh, is very stubborn and jealous and possessive and selfish and a financial mess. This person just really doesn't have anything of value to add, is about to be left behind. So if you are that person... Um, well, good luck. Talk to you later.